Hi Cancer, welcome to Blue Hill Tarot. We're going to do a mid-month April 2024 energy update. So right now we have the uh, Mercury retrograde and that will be ending on the 25th of April. Um, the next thing I want to mention is uh, the second quarter moon energy in Cancer is uh, going to be a beginning on the 15th of this month, just a couple days away. And we have a full moon in Scorpio. Should be quite interesting, uh, passionate, uh, aggressive energy there on the 23rd of April. So let's show your card uh, cards for uh, the energy of Cancer. This is Blue Hill Tarot. I hope you'll support my channel by liking, subscribing, commenting. And here we go. Cancer messages for Cancer Oh, And this is the Newman deck. First card out is the Eight of Swords, the energy of the Hermit, and the energy of manifesting. Beautiful. Uh, so the Nine of Wands, the energy of the Hierophant, the Fool, beautiful, the energy of Fire, the energy of Learning, and the energy of You. You show up in position nine, the last card, and you show up as the High Priestess. This is a Cancer energy specific, so it's beautiful. It looks like you're being still. Uh, there is some baggage around you, around some relationships that you are dealing with. I'm going to throw a few more cards, but I do see the energy of um, something that you're trying to let go of. And it looks like you're going to. Uh, you're going to move past some energy or circumstance that, uh, you know, is something you've been dealing with. Whether it's around your job, your money, your work, your love life, there's something that you've been holding on to that you've been kind of, uh, you know, um, chained to that you're going to release. Maybe you'll finally release it for good. It's something you've gone back and forth with. It could be around any energy. We're going to get some clarity, but the energies we have here right now are the energy of fire, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Um, the energy of an earth sign, Taurus. The energy of an earth sign, Virgo. Here we go. Clarity, clarity. There you are again. All right. Consequences. All right. Well, listen. <laughs> All right, can't. <laughs> Well, you're having some consequences. Uh, you guys uh, that are cancer energies dealing uh, certainly with the energy of a fire sign, uh, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Um, you're dealing with possibly some consequences. It certainly could also connect with the Taurus earth energy. And um, yeah, so I do see progress around your finances. If you are a cancer who's uh, changing jobs or has a job and you're making choices and decisions around your work or you're moving from location to location, whatever it may be, you're on the right track. And this is the Ten of Pentacles. And these cards showing up in position three are really positive around you, cancers manifesting. So there's opportunities around work. So if, if necessary, put all this other stuff on the back burner and just go to work because you definitely have some consequences uh, around relationships that you're trying to let go that have been long term or family connections that people that you just need to kick to the curb or put on the back burner and you just have it. You keep going back and forth. You show up connected also with the energy of air and you're confused. There's things right below the surface. It ultimately speaks to the energy of all these, all the energies are here. We have um, the energy of fire, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. We have the energy of water, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. We have the energy of a, specifically a Taurus and a Virgo. And we have the energy, um, yeah, that's it. So it does look to me like by the end of this month, you may be saying, okay, I've got to get, get back on track here. I'm passionately connected to something, whether it be around my family, the dynamic there, or some relationship. I need to get back on track and put that on the back burner. And maybe you'll want to go ahead and do that 
sooner rather than later because the universe is sort of guiding and directing you to do that. And if you make that choice, you'll be able to release some of this baggage. And it certainly could be around an air sign, uh, Gemini, Aquarius, Libra, because they are definitely here with long-term baggage. But absolutely, it could be also around the energy of fire or pretty much any other earth, air, water, or fire. You have a lot of energies around. But somebody here is uh, a circumstance where you've gone back and forth, you held on, released. Maybe it's someone in your family that, uh, you know, you just can't connect with and deal with uh, the, their circumstances correctly. Maybe it's a relationship issue. Whatever it is, the energy speaks to you being sort of pulled back, paying attention, being quiet. And the, the answers are coming toward you now. So you will figure it out, Cancer. It's absolutely... Uh, positively going to happen. So keep going, be positive, be present. And thank you so much for stopping at Blue Hill Tarot. Please subscribe. Take care.